All right, guys, today we're going to be looking at the Vupu Drag from Vupu Tech. It's a super enjoyable mod, really powerful, goes up to 157 watts, has that gene chip in there. Before we get into all that, let's go over what I'm vaping. I'm dripping Vagabond from True Merchant Co. I'm at 100 watts, 1.14 ohms, and uh, let's take a few drags, then dive down to the table, get up close and personal with the Vupu Drag. Hmm. It's a really enjoyable vape. I just love the aesthetics of it. I love the hand feel. Yeah, it's a nice one. A couple things before we dive down deep. I just want to say thanks to everybody who's been watching. Thanks to all the supporters out there. And um, yeah, continue to tune in. I'll be doing a thousand follower giveaway. We're at uh, over 500 now. I've been gaining followers and I just want to thank you guys for uh, staying interested and, and tuning in especially on the Instagram page. Um, yeah, go to, to uh, Instagram at True Merch Reviews. Give us a follow. There's a bunch of content on there I share daily. And then our YouTube channel here, uh, True Merch Vape Reviews. So once again, just thank you guys for all the love and support. I plan on giving that back to you, especially uh, since you know this community has done so much for me. So let's take one last drag and get up close and personal with the Vupu drag. <laughs> Alrighty guys, here's the Vupu drag in the box. We got Vupu and drag with gene chip on the front there. Really nice box. I like it. Um, it's got your color coordination there, your barcode. Tells you what color the uh, the mod should be inside. Got the contents on the back. You should have one mod, a warranty card, a USB cable, and a user manual. So let's crack it open and find out what we got. And there she is, the Vupu drag. So you get one mod, lift this stuff up, and they didn't lie to us. We got one USB cable, one user manual, one warranty card, and then this little chip, which is cool, this little cardboard, it says Gene on it, and then on the back, see it says, powerful chip born for fever, Gene. I don't know if it's Genie or Gene, I'm going to say Gene just to make it easier I don't want to guess so let's move this stuff to the side and get acquainted with the Vupu drag <clears throat> alright so here's the mod I got it in uh, the silver and carbon fiber look and it's beautiful I've had this thing for like a week and there's not a single nick or scratch on it these really nice beveled edges nice gold plated copper 510 connection I love this plate it's raised so you don't get any rings or scratching from your RDAs so this is 24 or 25 uh, millimeters in diameter. So anything over 25 millimeters, you're going to get some overhang. When we get, uh, we're going to get into that here in a second. When I put an RDA on there, I'll show you why these bevels may be an issue to some people. You have your display, your fire button, wattage up, wattage down, your USB port for your charging and upgradable firmware. Here's the front, and then this is your battery door. Get your finger right in there and it comes off the bottom with your battery vents and then here is the battery sled slash terminal nice and clean I love the white I really like that and then at the top it says just drag gene chip got your positive and negative nice battery strap let's go ahead and throw some fresh batteries in here and we'll fire it up I'm using 35 amp efest batteries Got them wrapped nice and black. That's how I like them. All right, so the first one is positive up. Next one, positive down. Make sure your battery strap is secured. And throw that door on there. So there you have your, uh, your screen. Now the cool thing about this is you can flip the display and it also has a super vape mode. But first, if you hit one, two, three, that's going to change it to your stainless steel temperature mode. One, two, three. You have your temperature mode for nichrome. One, two, three. Temperature mode for one, two, three. There we go. Titanium. Back to power. One, two, three, and you're good to go. So another cool thing about this is if you go above 129 watts, it goes to super vape. You can see that slight change. I know it's hard to focus, so you guys aren't going to see it. But you see that change in the screen. It says super right there. 
So anything above 129, it's super vape. I don't really know the practical use of it, but uh, it's pretty neat. So yeah, let's uh, let's go ahead and throw this uh, this Goon 1.5 on here, and I'll show you something you might not like about the bevels. So this is a 24 millimeter RDA, and because of the bevels, it kind of looks like a slight overhang, but it's it's flush. There's no overhang, no overhang in the front or on the sides. But because of that bevel, you know, it might look at some angles. It might look weird. It's not a con to me, but to some people it might be. I think it's great. So uh, when you put an RDA on here, it asks you if it's a new coil, yes or no. Wattage up is yes, wattage down is no. I'm going to say yes and show you guys that now, because I have 0.14 ohm coils in here, it's reading out at 0.14, so it's giving me recommended wattage of 80. So this chip super cool if uh, any RDA you put on here anytime you put a coil on here it'll read it and then go to the recommended wattage for those ohms so that's a really neat feature uh, let's crank it up to 100 watts that's where I like to vape this bad boy at 0.14 ohms so there it is there's the Vupu drag with the goon 1.5 I think it's a beautiful setup I really like this vape let's come off the table and uh, go back take a few drags and talk about it all right, guys, here we are at the Vupu Drag. Let's crank it up to super mode real quick, and then we'll talk a little bit about it. Super Vape, 131 watts. Hmm, man, I need some juice. Let's blossom some juice in that Goon 1.5. I notice a denser, hotter cloud. Um, really enjoyable. The flavor was amazing off of that. I'm going to crank it back down to 100 watts. And uh, yeah, I, I can't find anything I don't like about it. Some people might not like the bevel. All I can say is, Vupu, come out with a drag RDA and come out with different battery doors that you can buy. And this thing will be flying off the shelves. It already is flying off the shelves. People are buying this thing. I keep seeing it all over Instagram. They're raving about it, but they just started their marketing campaign for the Vupu 2 with the changing doors. Do your customers a favor, come out with doors for this, and come out with a drag RDA. That's all I ask. Other than that, under 60 bucks, it's a great vape. Has the different modes, three different modes, super stylish, super affordable, super vape. What more do you want? That's, that's all you can ask for. So I think it's a great vape. I think more people definitely need to get a drag in their hands, and uh, yeah, let's take a few drags, and then we'll thank who we have to thank, and get out of here. You guys like my half-ass O's? I'm getting better at it. I'm trying. So, yeah, first of all, thanks to everybody out there watching. Thanks to everybody who's following us on Instagram. Follow us at True Merch Reviews, at True Merch Co., and at True Dreams underscore TDT. That's my vape team, my company, and my review page. Thanks for watching us on YouTube. Um, thanks for all the love and support, really. This community means the world to me, so I just want to give that back to you guys. Stay tuned for our 1,000 follower giveaway. We're going to be giving away a mod and a line of juice, possibly a t-shirt. Who knows what else if other companies want to get involved. Yeah, I'm super excited about this one. I have some more reviews coming up uh, later in the week for you guys. A couple more mods, some juices. So yeah, that's, that's all I have to say. Let's take a couple more drags and get out of here so we can enjoy the rest of our weekend. Final plug, you can get this shirt, True Merch & Co. Classic Ohms at TrueMerchCo.us. You can get our juice. I'm dripping Vagabond, my line. Hit us up on Instagram at True Merch Co. or True Merch Reviews. Thanks again for watching, guys. And as always, keep it cloudy and be unique.